All right, we both agree defense is going to – they're going to have to play well. Who not named Miles Garrett do you think is a key this year? It's a great question, um, and, and I do think as a whole the, the secondary is going to have to to play well. Um, obviously, that starts with, with Denzel Ward, but expecting big things from Greg Newsom in year two. Uh, Greedy Williams, who, let's face it, he might not be on the Browns next year. He's in a contract year because they just might not be able to pay him addition by subtraction. Um, so expecting that trio of cornerbacks to really be able to lock things down in the defensive, the, the, the back end of the defense. And I think the, you, listen, if you want to talk about the weaknesses on this defense, and I think defensive line is one of those things, they'll at least get pressure with Garrett and Clowney. And, you know, you have that great secondary on the back end that can kind of take care of things back there. That is the recipe for having a great defense throughout the season. So I think despite maybe some of the questions along the defensive front, they're going to be okay because of that. I also think JOK in year two is a guy that I really am going to be watching because we know the Browns linebackers haven't been, the, they haven't had the greatest linebacking core in recent years, but I have high hopes for him. He's a guy that can play sideline to sideline do some things in coverage. He looked pretty good in the games he played in the preseason, flying up and being being instinctual, making plays. So he's another guy that I think has to have a good season, especially knowing, like I just alluded to at the beginning of this conversation, if you don't if you don't feel as confident in the the interior of the defensive line, that's where a guy like JOK can really step up and be the guy making plays as if a guy breaks through and gets to that second level. So those are just some of the names, but yeah, you're you're 100% right about this defense as a whole, David, because I mean, man, like they, they, we all kind of knew going in that there was going to be some growing pains, a lot of new faces, a lot of changes on that side of the ball. But now this year, they got to be off and running. Like they, they don't have time to kind of feel things out and, and hope that they get it together late in the year. They got to come out of the gate really being the strong, the strong suit of this team to kind of carry the workload as as Jacoby Brissett starts for 11 games. Yeah, and, um, you know, they played well at the end of last year. They need to pick right back up.